Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So are you using iPad Air, iPad Pro, and iPad Mini? And is that your iPad having problem with the dim and low brightness issue on your iPad? Or is your brightness goes too down and goes too dark and you can't see anything just like that? Well, if you're having problem with the brightness issues on your iPad, don't worry, let me go ahead and quickly show you how you can solve the problem. Alright, now to solve your brightness issues on your iPad, the first work you want to do, just go ahead and swipe down from the top and tap and hold your brightness slider. And make sure to turn up the True Tone features on your iPad. Now, go back here and choose your settings. Now, choose Accessibility, then tap Display and Take Size. First, let's go all the way down here and turn up Auto Brightness. Now, pretty often, turning on your Auto Brightness can automatically dim your brightness depending on various scenario. So, turning off these features will help you to just keep your brightness to stay in the same at always. At the same time, next things you have to do, you need to turn up reduce white points. Now, here is why. If I turn this off, you'll be able to see now brightness is become more brighter. However, if you see this option, this actually makes your brightness dimmer than before. Okay, so just go ahead and turn up the reduce white point to solve your problem. At the same time, you scroll a little up and turn up different it without color and increase your contrast. Just go ahead and enable this and right after that just get out of here and now if possible just go ahead and give it a restart on your iPad and then check your brightness issue whether it's still there or not. Well, let's say you have done doing the restart, but still you have the problem with your brightness. Now, the next things we're going to talk about is the update. If that happens because of your software, then updating to the latest software version will solve the problem. Therefore, if you found out the new software available, go ahead and update it, and after that, your problem will be solved. Alright guys, hope you find this video useful. If you think so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.